And if you look at if you look at salaries, um, was there a huge impact then in terms of 2020? And mm-hmm. what do you think will happen in 2021 on software developers? Yeah. Within the salary, look, I, I didn't see, I expected a, a massive change, um, I guess, because of that uncertainty. Um, but if I'm completely honest, we didn't see a huge change within that 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 area, simply because the demand, because we knew this was, was, wasn't, was this is temporary, it wasn't a permanent issue, we weren't going to live with COVID for the rest of our lives, you know, it was definitely always going to be something that we could figure out, you know, um, so because it was temporary, I guess you've seen a lot of, a lot of companies that were hiring, were still being quite competitive, mm. because they were still up against other tech companies that were hiring as well. And we did see an awful lot of growth within particular areas, within life science, within healthcare, that we're still paying quite high. So if you're looking at a company that isn't necessarily directly related within those areas, we're up against those sort of companies. They couldn't yep. drop their salaries. They yep. couldn't because they would never they would never get the candidate. You know, they wouldn't win at the end of the day. So we didn't see a massive change. Where I did see a slight drop was the less in demand roles. So we've seen a drop in salaries around those support roles and yep. um, system administrators, application support. Um, we did see some layoffs within those areas as well because there wasn't as much of a need. So, you know, there was cutting around areas that they could have developers to do the support um, yep. if they were less busy, you know. So we did see a drop within those salaries. But for the more niche areas or the more highly sought after talent, no it wasn't a massive drop within the salaries. We've seen a little bit around candidates willing to be a little bit more flexible than they used to be. Um, but if I'm completely honest, they still got what they wanted in the end. <laughs> it's interesting. And, and that's what I, that's what I mean by resilient. Um, because there's very few industries that, that, you know, salaries stayed the same, didn't take cuts. 